Hello, everybody. Something different today. We've all heard of the Antikythera mechanism. That's been well documented for 50, 60 years. We haven't heard of the brass geomantic instrument made by Muhammad ibn Qutluq al-Mausili in 1241-1242. This is described in the British Museum as a brass geomantic instrument. Apparently, what would happen is these dials would be turned, questions would be asked of a customer who wanted to learn his future, and this would reveal the future here. There is an inscription in the middle which reads, I am the revealer of secrets. In me are marvels of wisdom and strange hidden things. But I have spread out the surface of my face out of humility and have prepared it as a substitute for earth. From my intricacies there comes about perception superior to books concerned with the study of the art. And we don't know what effect turning any of these dials would have on our own lives if you believe in this kind of stuff. And I see no reason not to, as above, so below. It's ancient wisdom from ancient Egypt, basically. These dots here are basically the geomantic Western version of I Ching. If we look at I Ching, it is just so similar. It, they both seem to derive from a common ancestor. These are also the Mayan number system, but they were extinct as a number system in China long, long ago. We don't know how long ago. This was some system of understanding of as above, so below, as I can cast sand on the ground and, 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 and read the future, so the universe operates according to the very same laws and principles, and therefore I should be able to predict the future. And this was the understanding back then. And these are, these are the geomantic symbols in the West. They are so similar to I Ching. People aren't aware of the similarity or, or that in the West we even have such a system. This was in the Middle East for such a long time and, and is still being practiced. And of course, the earth, earth uses precise laws, and this is how the Egyptians understood the earth, as above, so below, as, as we can look at small things on the ground. So does the universe operate according to the same set of laws, and from this we can gain an understanding of the universe. Guys, thanks very much, and please subscribe.